What is going on everybody? Thank you for clicking the link. This is your boy Crisis 20, where real tutorials will take you to the next level. Today, we are going to try to fix your Windows 10 updates, all right? And at the same time, we're going to try to fix your WUAU service. Yeah, WUAU service, all right? Those two go hand in hand when you are trying to update Windows. I already know, guys, I already know. Y'all guys been Googling left and right and just can't figure this thing out and then have to wipe your whole computer, don't worry. I'm hoping this video is for you, all right? So this is what you guys will be learning today. <laughs> so as I said before, this is to try to fix your Windows updates. Also, guys, keep in mind, this may not fix your issue, but I'm really, really hoping that it does. If this method does not work, I will leave a link down below for other steps to try to fix your issue. All right, well, no further ado, let's jump on the computer and let's get started. All right, so I'm on my PC now. Before I get into anything, I almost forgot. This fix also fixes issues with the Microsoft Store. So if you can't update any apps or anything to that nature, this fixes it as well. All right, so let me show you the error messages I was getting. I was getting this one here. I was getting this Windows Update error, which uh, gave me that code or something similar. Then I was trying to troubleshoot, and while troubleshooting, I was then hit with this error message. Also, at the same time, I was getting this right here. I was not able to update my Microsoft Store apps. I was getting hit with all of them. So again, as I said, this fix should fix all three of these issues. So my problem was I was missing some important keys inside of the registry editor. After I updated Windows a while back, for some unknown reason, somewhere down the line, I was not able to update my Windows again. And all of the problem and error messages I talked about before. So what I did was this. So I went to the registry editor. You'll follow this path right here. So I'm gonna just show you really quick. So it's the H key local machine, system, current control set, services. Click a folder, then you'll just type WU and it will lead you right to the folder that you need to look at. Now, if you're looking at this, compare this to what you have on your computer now. If you see some keys missing, then that is your problem. You do not have the complete set of registry keys for Windows to update, nor the Microsoft Store to update. So to fix this, you're gonna need a couple things. You're going to need another computer that's Windows 10, all right? You need to also, on that computer, go to this same exact location and export this registry key. So what you're exporting is the WUAUServe folder. All right, you need to export that whole registry key. Then you're going to export it to either a USB, OneDrive, Google Drive, whatever have you. You need to get it to your computer. How you would export is this, you'll go here, right click, and then you hit export. You can save it to your desktop, your USB, or wherever you would like to save your registry key at. Name it whatever you want to name it, and then go ahead and click save. Basically, you're saving a functional working registry key. So once you put the registry key on your desktop or wherever you like to put it, then this is where you'll do what I told you earlier. You would place it on a USB or a cloud service, something of that nature, and then put it on your PC. So you're asking to yourself, but I don't have another computer in the house. Where am I gonna get a registry key from? Well, you're in luck. I'm gonna give you guys my registry key so that way you can use it on your computer. So I'm gonna place it in my Discord. There'll be a link in the description to get to my Discord. I'm going to place it here in 
the lab freebies, all right? I didn't do it yet, but it will be there by the time. <laughs> It'll be there by the time you guys see this. So go ahead and grab it from there and you should be good to go. So now the file is on your computer. So it's gonna look something like this. Go ahead and double click it. Once you double click it, you'll hit run. It's gonna pull up the UAC or user access control. You wanna hit yes here. And then it's gonna bring up this message. You just wanna hit yes and then that is it. I'm not gonna do it because I already did it already and that's all you need to do. Once that is done, it will look like this here. Next, you want to run the WUAU SERV service. So if we go to start, type in services, hit enter or click the services app above, type in WU and it will lead you right to the service which we need to start. Double click on the service, Make sure the startup type is automatic, start the service, and then hit OK. Or you can go to the command prompt, so start CMD, hit enter or click the app, type in net start W U A U S E R V, hit enter. As you can see, it started successfully. And if I move over to the services side, you can see that it's running. Click OK and close out all of the menus. I forgot to mention that once you add the registry to your system, this should work. All you have to do is just go to your settings, go to update, and then just check for updates. Also, you know, to show you the Microsoft Store, you'll go here, go to updates, and then just get updates. So that is pretty much what you have to do to fix this issue. Okay, so just a quick recap. Remember, the fix, you have to go get a working WUA SERV registry key. In order for you to do that, either go to my Discord or go to a working Windows 10 PC. Go to the registry path that I showed you earlier in the video. Export the WUA you serve registry folder. Once you export it to the desktop or wherever you want to save it, put it on your USB, put it on the cloud service, whatever, and then download it on your computer that is having the issue. Once you download it, double click the registry editor, hit yes twice, and then it's gonna add that registry key into the registry of your computer. After that, then you should be able to turn on your WUASERV service, okay? So you go to services and turn it on. Once you turn it on, then start updating your Windows and update your Microsoft Store. All right, so that is it, guys. I hope this helped you. If not, if I missed anything or if you're having some issues, I'll try to help you out the best way I can. As always, leave a comment below, like and subscribe if this helped you. And until next time, I'll catch you guys at another Windows 10 Fix tutorial. Peace.